In this video, we're gonna learn how to make this wavy rainbow gradient text effect really easily in Kittle, so let's get started. All right, so I have my text here. This is one text box with the word wave just typed out four times in each line. It, again, it's one text box, and I have applied a gradient to it. If you don't know how to do that, you can check the video up in the cards for how to do that. It's really easily done. And what we're gonna do is apply a flag shape to this, a flag transformation, which when I do that, it only applies to the first line, but what it does is it kind of packs the gradient that's happening overall into one text. So you can see here the green and the purple over on the left flows into the red and the yellow up top. And so now what I wanna do with this is duplicate it three times, which you can do by holding the Alt or the Option key on your keyboard and dragging. Then what I'm going to do is work on the gradient to fade from the red to be up top all the way down to the purple on the bottom. So that's what I want to have happen as opposed to this left to right style. I want the color to actually start from this red and go down to yellow. So here you can see there's the gradient colors, all four of them here. And what I'm going to do is just select the ones I don't want and delete them. Because again, I want the red and the yellow to be up top. And then I'm going to just adjust my degrees here to about 70. Again, you can do whatever you want with this. You can play with your degree setting to have it the exact angle that you want. But again, I'm just using the red and the yellow up top. Now I'm going to select the second text box. I'm going to grab the red and delete that, just hitting the back key or the delete key because we don't need it anymore. And then I'm also going to delete the purple because we're not there yet. So this second one is going to be yellow and green. So hopefully you can kind of see what we're doing here in fading the red down to the yellow. So now that we have the uh, green and the yellow the way we want to do it, we're going to select the third box. I'm going to take off the yellow, I'm going to take off the red, and then this green and purple is what we want to have happen at the bottom. And then since the purple isn't really visible, I'm going to take this swatch and actually drag it up to reveal more of that purple here. And so now we have all three of these with a gradient color happening all the way down, and you can make some really cool products like you see right here, great for mugs, hats bags, t-shirts, anything like that in print on demand. So I hope you have a ton of fun with this, making your own wavy rainbow gradient text effect. <laughs> 